Hi everyone. So as you know, throughout February, I'm doing relationship tips and this is just a quick tip today. And that is to try to do activities jointly as a couple. Now, there's going to be a lot of times where you have completely different interests. So I'm not trying to say that you need to be a couple who does everything together. I know that there are couples that literally do everything together. They don't do any separate activities and that's okay because it's about your relationship and what works for you. However, it's really important to just sit back and think, what can we do as a couple? That might just be an activity that you do at home. It might just be, do you know what? We're going to watch TV together. We're going to um, do a board game together. It could be planning something outside of the home that you're going to do. Going for walks. Now, going for walks is free, but also it provides like so much opportunity for you to connect as a couple because you can have co conversations you can be aware of your surroundings. You know, you can go to a beautiful location. You can walk together. So it's exercise as well. There's so much you can get out of things like that. So think about an activity you can do as a couple and maintain it. So it might be once a month, we're just going to go for a walk or it could be every uh, two weeks we're going to do an activity. You could even make it fun. You could say you could have an activities box or jar where you put lots of activities in and then every like month or every few weeks you pick one of you picks one out and then that's what you do. Now, obviously things are going to be dependent on time, on money. So you just have to be creative, I suppose. But it's about what you get out of it. The value of doing things as a couple instead of doing everything separately is going to be, you know, worth it in the end. So that's my tip. Do activities as a couple. Thanks for watching. Bye.